What's up YouTube, it's your boy Willie the Gun Guy. Let's go ahead and like and subscribe the video. It takes about five seconds, show me some love. If you already are subscribed, you know what I'm saying. Thank you, and if you're about to subscribe, welcome to the Gun Gang family. Today we got a quick video. Um, it's about the SAR-9. I recently just purchased a SAR-9, so we're gonna go ahead and do an unboxing video. i uh, also do a shooting video for you guys. Um, so let me go ahead and close this up, show you guys what the hard case look like. Cause it is a hard case. Boom, simple as that. The back doesn't have anything on there. Uh, <clears throat> so SAR USA by SAR Zilmas. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Let me tell you where this gun is from. So the gun is from, I believe, Turkey. Yeah, so. Right there for you guys. Do a second wallet. You know, I can never figure out how to make these things. There you go. Boom, made in Turkey. SAR 9, boom. It is empty, by the way. Well, not anymore. And then right there for you guys, it's the other side. Boom. Oh, and then here's the grip. So, I actually love the color on this gun. The black and the uh, gunmetal gray. Um, really, really nice. <clears throat> so, my first thoughts, impressions of this gun is, man, it looks really nice. Um, it is a little bit heavier than my other guns. Uh, so, that just probably just means it's made out of good material. I actually don't know. I don't know about SARS. It's actually my first SAR that I have. Um, so... Let's go ahead and get what's actually in the box. So, SAR-9, it's a pamphlet, you know what I'm saying? Comes with a lock as all guns do. Let's see what's in this bag. So yeah, maintenance and spare parts list. So, simple as that. <clears throat> This is actually from AZ Firearms. Uh, I didn't go to MOAZ for this one, went to AZ Firearms. And look what they're writing about, mental health. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get your mind right before you do things. So I definitely appreciate them for putting that in there. A lot of people don't understand about mental health and it is a real thing, so. Uh, right here, based off of looking, it looked like extra grips. Yeah, it's extra grips, so. There we go. Boom, and then we have. <clears throat> let me see. Oh, so AZ Farm plugging, huh? They put stickers in there. <gasps> Boom. And then you actually got a sticker by SAR as well. SAR USA sticker. And like I said, we got the lock in there. So, here's the gun. Gun comes with two 17 round mags. Boom, and then this is what the gun looks like when it comes in the case as well. So they don't have the mags out the gun. Uh, they have the gun in the actual case. And then this is what it looks like. I'm sorry, I mean they have the mag in the gun and then the other mag in the case. Boom. <clears throat> so it's a really durable case, really durable gun. Now let's go ahead and start talking about the gun. So, a lot of people always ask to do the trigger pull, see how, see how the trigger is. Uh, it's a, it's a decent amount of slack right there. I'm not going to lie to you. So if you can see it, let me show you from this side. So it is a decent amount of slack. Uh, to be honest, it kind of reminds me of a clock, if you can be honest with you. Uh, just by looking at it, you have the, I think they're called stippling, whatever, whatever the thing's called, but... 
what that is, it's basically the grip to help you um, cock the gun back or whatever. Um, so yeah, this is the Star, the Star 9. Good trigger pull. Good mag, good quality. Um, I see a lot of guns with actually these mags. I forget the, who, who makes them, uh, but good quality mags. So I'll go ahead and put a shooting video in with this video. It's made from, it says SAR USA, made in Turkey. Uh, has a thumb safety on both sides. It's funny because I think I showed you the same side. And then I believe it breaks down like a Glock as well. Boom. Which nowadays, a lot of guns break down like Glocks. <clears throat> Which I don't know if it's like Glocks or who, or who came up with it, but the easy breakdown process. Uh, and just like that, it's all broken down. Boom, boom. Yes, sir. So, I mean, that's really it for the video. Just wanted to show you guys this new SAR that I've got. Um, like I said, got metal gray. It's a decent trigger pull. Um, a lot of people don't care about that. A lot of people just like to have a firearm. Um, and then we got the ambidextrous thumb safety, so it's on both sides. Works both ways. Um, only thing, the only thing I can say uh, about this, let me put it back together, is that. So the safety is really, really, really hard to maneuver. Like, not pointing at myself, by the way, guys, but just based on the safety, it's really hard to maneuver. And as well as the safety, uh, the mag release really, really, I say that's the only two pros uh, with the with the gun. It has really nice sights. Front and back match up really well. The gun is a really nice color. Um, <clears throat> take it out to go shooting. I'm gonna put some rounds through it. Let you guys know what I think about it. But like I said, this is a SAR 9, guys. Have a good day.